Find a way to get us up to that legal section, Ron. Right. Shout if Madam Pinch shows up. anything that could help us with Buckbeak's defense? Yes, and I've already dropped the book off at Hagrid's. Hang on, how did you do that? We only just left you. Well, um, I took a shortcut. Come on, we don't want to be late for charms class. It's right over there. Eee! Get these horrid things away from me! Run! It's completely bad! <laughs> oh no! Maybe we'd better have a look. Um, don't we have charms class now? Yes, but I think we have time to teach that thing a lesson. Whatever it is. It's up to you, Harry. Don't worry, we'll take care of it. Good luck. I, 
I'd stay and help, but uh, uh, I'm late. Yes, uh, very late indeed. So we could win all five cards in the set. The oh, oh, oh. Things are good. for the Monster Book of Monsters. It's a bit sad, really. Seems like we should have tried to tame it. Hermione! Charms class. Can't chat right now. I'm off to Charms class. Hello, class. I'm Professor Flitwick. Welcome to Charms. Today, we will learn a very useful freezing charm called Glacius. Let's see. Who would like to demonstrate? Harry Potter, just the fellow. If you'd like to step through this door, we can begin the Glacius Challenge. Glacius is useful for freezing a number of things, Harry. Let's begin with an Amazonian salamander, shall we? Take care now, Harry. You'll need to eliminate both the creature and its fire. Give it a try. Glacier! Glacier! Work, Harry. Now, Harry, see if you can use the Glacier spell to freeze this flowing water. Glacier! Excellent! 
excellent. Wow, it's solid ice. Here's the best bit, Harry. Time to go for a slide. Just use the left and right arrow keys to turn. Press the up arrow to go faster and the down arrow to slow down. Off you go. I'll see you at the end of the challenge. Huh? Alahamora! Huh? Alahamora! Huh? 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 Huh?
I see you didn't find all of the challenge shields. Ah, it's a shame. Well, come back any time you want to give the challenge another try. Find all ten shields and you'll get to go to the bean bonus room. Thanks, Professor Flitwick. I'll be back. So, how was it? You can freeze things now. I can slide everywhere. Oh, wicked! And salamanders the size of Hagrid. The blue or the scarlet variety. It doesn't really matter, I suppose. You can have another go at the Glacier's Challenge if you want, Harry. Or we can come back later. Despite the dangerous visitor lurking around Hogwarts, Harry insisted on going to visit Hagrid. He was anxious to hear the outcome of Buckbeak's trial. Was that? I think it was. Poor Buckbeak! Poor Hagrid. They've carried out the execution. Look! It's Scabbers! You see, Ron? Crookshanks was innocent! You naughty rat! Oh, run! Ah, 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 Harry, look out! Ah, the ah, if that dog can get in, we can.
Where does this tunnel come out? I don't know. But we've got to help Ron. Do you hear something? The Pogo! Better both cast at one with the Sempra! With the Sempra! The Pogo! Pogo! The Pogo! See a way back up. Keep looking. I'll see if I can find a way down to you. Right then. How do I get across this? Suck on it.
hope Ron's all right.
the dog it's not a dog <sighs> there's no need to be afraid Sirius black is not what you think he is and scabbers he's not a rat he's a <sighs> wizard by the name of Peter Pettigrew what watch Pettigrew's an Animagus. It wasn't Sirius Black who betrayed your parents, Harry. It was Pettigrew. Peter Pettigrew had not only betrayed James and Lily Potter to Voldemort, he had also framed Sirius Black as Voldemort's spy. It was agreed that Pettigrew would be taken back to Hogwarts and turned over to Professor Dumbledore. But there was one more secret to be revealed that night. It doesn't leave me. What's wrong? Transformed into a rat. Is he all right? He's breathing at least. Professor Lupin is a werewolf. That sounded like a dog. It must be him. Go and help Sirius. I'll take care of Ron. him alone! He's innocent! Expect them to find him! 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 Expect them to find them! Expect them to find them! For a brief moment, Harry thought he saw someone trying to help him. Was it his father? But no. It couldn't be. Harry, are you all right? What's happened? Is Sirius okay? Where's Ron? Madam Pomfrey says Ron will be all right. He just needs some rest. Unfortunately, Sirius Black is not faring so well. He's locked in a high tower. He'll be handed over to the Dementor soon. There's nothing I can do to stop it. But he's innocent! I believe that's true. What we need is more time. But... oh! The Time Turner! Time Turner? More than one innocent life could be saved tonight. I meant to tell you. Eventually. Professor McGonagall let me borrow this Time Turner. I've been using it all year to go back in time so I could attend extra lessons. That explains a lot. We could use it to go and save Buckbeak. And then fly him up to the tower to rescue Sirius. But we must take care not to be seen by our earlier selves. Got bug 
beak in there somewhere. It's awfully quiet. You're sure you set the time turner back the right amount? <laughs> 